22. Right in the first tackle was Akadi. Something on here for the French inside ball is the money ball over the halfway. And this could level the score. With the kick to come, you'd expect the lead for France. That patience is started from deep. And just by himself a bit of time, a bit of breath, and it's the captain. Tiffus for the French. Second. Quick tap and go from Kadion. They find a bit of space over the 22. And that is the captain. Terry Bourla. The day. It's a great contest on the second pool game, but the breakthrough has come through. Julien Cadillon will go over for France's first try. Bourla. Out on the left hand side for France. Better continuity as they find space. Still going in a powerful run from Dalinga. Manu Dalinga, the try scorer. Disgusted. Look at this. It's a handoff. It's a second handoff. It's far too easy. It's a third handoff. It's a fourth handoff. And it's a try for Dalinga. Well worked. Good strength, but poor defense. Feeling out as. France retain from the scrum the position the inside ball to the captain Terry Burawa and another try for France try number three comfortable start the inside ball is a magic ball and good positioning found the space nobody in sight and a good finish from the French and the Japanese win some ball back but it's an intercept given away there's another try for the French Manuel Dalinga, he's sick. Oh, the Hooters gone. Not committing on defense, saw the Japanese, and a simple two and one. The final pass goes through, and Jonathan Lugel, the try scorer. He claimed advantage from Iningo. High tackle. Still got the advantage. High tackle, and a space has been found. Bursting straight through. Little tap and go. Looks like the captain. Terry Burua. Time. Time to keep a Japanese defender out the game. Iningo's pass was a good one. A step powerful run. Will he go all the way? And Elkadi. Jeremy Elkadi, the try scorer. France in control. And this could be the highest score against Japan for the free. It's showing the outside steps and goes. Too much pace. The handoff, well, probably not even necessary. He had so much pace, and over he went. Super little footwork. And it is a to tackle. Still on the attack for France. Lacafia, Lacafia, the power just five meters short. Good support play. Manuel Daringa scores. Oh, the kick pass was definitely on there. As hang on to the ball was Julian Cardellon. But it's. A favorable opening on the left hand side. La Cafia, the Blue with the clean out. Teddy Brower, the captain, look at that. A little sneaky one. I love this kid, though, Pierre Gillies. La Cafia, he's got everything. He's got size, he's got speed. Bell by two points now on the attack. The French, very slow start to the day, but they could finish strong. The break from the captain, Terry Guadalupe. And that try puts the French to awarded to the France. They want to go quickly here. Tap taken by Inya. And Barak. And then into the corner they go. Through Pierre Gilles Lacafia. And they needed something special against Fiji. If they were to qualify for the cup quarter final, they were unable to do so. But uh, the captain has sighed through a gap here. And Burahua. Burahua with a man to his right who he's not going to need. Julian Candelon was waiting. Uh, and another beautifully contestable one. It was Lacafia, the other try scorer who was up there. But finally, some possession for Canada. And what do they do? Throw an intercept pass. And a 
penalty try awarded by the looks of things is going to be on the challenge trophy quarterfinals they lead by 28 points to nil over it's canada over. two tries from this man and it's going to be a hat trick for the captain terry burahua is putting on a sevens masterclass in cape town in this game the canadians simply have no answer continues to impress from france and some pretty nifty stepping as well then the ball is out wide for Barak. Unfortunately for him on the bounce, he had a, a lot of ground to go back and make up, but uh, has found a hole in the defence, and it will be a try now for Jonathan Largel. Take play to the 22, the offload. Brilliant defence from the Russians. Gadlon, one-on-one, -on -one, desperate defence, and good support player, Joel, you touch on him, and a finisher as the captain, Terry. France have done brilliantly to keep that ball. Oh, oh, bad break straight through the middle. Arkady won't need any support. He'll go all the way. And this score should level the scores in a great. And Arkady with a little step, little show of real gas as well. Gone. Russian defense will be kicking themselves, but Arkady is in. The tires, the scores are tied. Conversion was good. Yeah, yeah, yeah. The chance now for France. Lacafia goes over. Oh. Back to Ekadi, and it opens up for France. The chase is on, but he slams it down. And so ah! Turnover is good. Turnover is good for France, and uh, Burawa looks up. Nobody in front of him. If anyone can steal a try, it is Thierry Burawa, and he goes gives us to its captain look at the dummy and go bounces off his own player and he's just so quick over the it's coming back for france perez stepping in straight through stefan got a guy at first receiver who's strong and can step like that you can see the rush defense from the pumas you can't do that that close france 